Do you know something like Corrie? It's a bit of a blessing and a curse, isn't it? Because it's a big beast, it's a huge show, it's very prestigious, but then when you come out of it, yeah. there's sometimes a danger that... Very difficult. Very yeah. Uncastable sometimes. Yeah. Just because you're so synonymous with that character. You're in, that, uh, you're in people's houses for mm -hmm. five nights So how nights long did it take for you to kind of get a foothold back into it's what It's not quite were finished doing. yet. Was that nine years ago? So yeah. no, Not quite as long <laughs> as that. No, no, it took a few years where you're just pretty much uncastable in television for a few years, which was fine because you need a little... You, you need to get back to mm. sanity, really. It's crazy. I mean, that show, those guys on that show, you're working 12-hour um, days, you've got your travel in and out, your makeup, your stuff, and then you've got to go home at night and learn another 30 pages for the next day. It really is, it's, it's full on. Mm. It's, um, yeah. yeah. You're at an interesting stage of your life. You're 50, you're single. You're I'm not 50, you've had your how dare you? <laughs> oh, you're not 50, are you? No, how dare you? You're nearly 50, you're nearly 50, I, I, you're single and I you've had a, your hips done. I have, I have. You're ready for action, aren't you? <laughs> What's it like? Well, I have had my hips done. <laughs> both? Um, both. That's interesting. Yeah. But that's, that's you and the Queen Mother. Did she, she, had both did, she have both done, yeah. did she have them both done together? With great respect to her, no, separately, but with great respect to her, she was in her 90s, I right. think. So what, what went on the, with you? I don't know, I just I did a lot of... Uh, I was a hurdler when I was at school. Ah. And I was ah. a big rock climber and, and uh, Monroe's... Monroe's are anything that are 3,500 foot. Um, in Scotland, the mountains, and I was a big bagger. I did mm. a bit fifth, late 50s, 55, 56, I think I got. And I used to run up and run down them, and oh, that, that pounding. Wow. And it would have happened to me anyway, okay. and I was in a position at the time, if I'd had to wait for the NHS, they would have probably kept me maybe 10 years. Yeah. So I was in a position to have them done privately, and I had them done mm. just like around it. the quarry time. So if you saw me in a wheelchair or with a... That's why. <laughs> it was just post-op, I think. <laughs>